Uh, good evening, triathletes. Now, for tonight's vlog, we will um, adjust the um, aero, pos aero position of this uh, aero bars of my child bike. Considering that uh, when I became a triathlete, it has been my obsession to have a perfect uh, aerodynamic position. However, I cannot simply say that I can achieve that perfect position uh, even in the future. But nevertheless, since uh, I have this obsession as a triathlete to 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 get that correct position of uh, aerodynamic, uh, I made some research that I discovered that the so-called praying mantis position, whereby we will now adjust the um, uh, position of this uh, aero bar, and it will be adjusted a bit, the, the front of this uh, aero bar will be adjusted a bit higher, as usual, so that we will now uh, achieve the so-called praying mantis position. Now, uh, again, uh, this is the uh, traditional position of the aero bar. It's a bit uh, horizontal, so if you position your hands in front of the or over the aero bars, you can see that uh, your hands are a bit uh, horizontal, whereby the direction of the wind will be coming here. So it it, it is more of a uh, aerodynamic uh, and traditional position. However, in in case of a the so-called um, praying mantis position, your hands will be a bit higher, uh, probably somewhere here. So this will be taken as one. The, the 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 direction of the wind will be coming from here. So your 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 hands will be taken as one from uh, to your body, so that the air will flow directly coming in front of you, and will be taken as one, so that you will achieve a better aerodynamic position compared to the one that your hands are basically uh, positioned uh, a bit lower, like just like this one, the traditional position, whereby uh, there there is a so-called uh, turbulence. Uh, you will experience because of the uh, wind that coming from this direction and then uh, landing in front of your body compared to that one whereby it is in this position so that uh, there is now a so-called uh, single unit as being a part of the aerodynamic position. Now, um, as you can see, this is uh, the position that uh, I am uh, accustomed to the traditional position of my hands are uh, horizontal. It may appear to be uh, the, the front end of the aero bars are a bit angled upward. However, if you can take a look at the angle of my hand, right hand, it is really straight. And that is the traditional aerodynamic position of the aero bar. Now, as we will adjust this later on, uh, you will, we, we will uh, change this one from this position up to somewhere here so we will now try we will now adjust this uh, um, aero bars now okay Again, uh, now this is the uh, so-called uh, praying mantis position. Take, if, if I will uh, place my hands on top of the aero bars, as you can see, the the angle now of my right hand and left hand are a bit are a bit uh, angled upward, particularly the the front end of uh, this aero bar, and together with my hands. Uh, and I will uh, check this uh, probably during the weekend if I will do my uh, basic training for this forthcoming uh, triathlon, uh, Mount Mayon uh, triathlon 2050. However, uh, as I was telling you earlier, uh, there is no hard and fast rule as far as aerodynamics is concerned. Again, this one is more of a experiment on my part, and and if you can, if you'd like to apply this one to your tri bike, it's, it's fine. But then again, if you're used to your position, the, the traditional state position uh, of your hand hands. Again, you can stick to it, but then again, I'll, I'll see if this one will really work for me. And if this one works uh, for me, then I will stick to this position. But nevertheless, if this one is not really for me, then I'll go back to the traditional one. So, I'll see what I can probably inform you later on of what is the um, outcome of this uh, praying mantis position. Uh, in the event that I'll finish my... Uh, probably training this coming weekend. Okay? Thank you very much.